Having a trade copier is a must if you're trading funded capital. So I'm trading with FTMO and I use social trader tools to copy over my trades. I have one live account, I have one live FTMO account and I have one uh, FTMO challenge account. They're all connected in the social trader tools uh, platform. So I just put in an order in my live account and it copies everything over. It calculates all of the risk parameters. So it's really, really good. It just simplifies the whole process. And if you're thinking about doing a challenge or you're already, already trading live, a trade copier is definitely uh, something you need to have. The biggest reason to use a trade copier is psychological. So you first it saves time. You don't need to copy over trades. It does everything automatically. It calculates the risks. So you don't even need to calculate the risk on each account. But the best reason is that you don't need to look at the big numbers. So you can have a small live account and everything will be copied over. You don't need to look at the big uh, profit targets or the big numbers going up, big numbers going down. You only look at your uh, small live account and uh, the psychological impact is much less. So let's take a look at the social trade tools platform where I will show you exactly what are the plans, which plans I use, how to set everything up and how I set up my risk parameters. Okay, so here we are on the social trader tools website in the pricing tab. Here we have the account hosting plans. And as I said, I have the $60 one with up to five accounts. I have three accounts, so this is the one I need. I started with the standard one, which was two accounts, but then as I progressed with my FTMOs, I uh, switched to $60. So this is, as I can see, the most popular one. Again, the prices are okay. It's not that expensive. It's definitely worth the price, I have to say. And uh, you just choose which, whichever one you need. Depends on how many accounts you have. There are also bigger options. You have up to 100 accounts. That is $1,000 per month. Uh, so that's really good for someone, um, for someone trading lots of investment accounts. Maybe lots of smaller investment accounts. He can just put them on the trade copier and not worry about them at all. Put the risk parameters in and it makes everything so much easier and much more simple. If you're trading investment capital, prop firm capital or small, uh, lots of smaller accounts, this is, a, this is definitely what you need. To, you need a uh, reliable trade copier to do everything for you and to make the whole process so much more simple and so much easier. So this is my personal dashboard with the free accounts I have. First, I have the master account, which is my small personal account. Then I have the challenge account that I'm doing currently. I am doing an, an FTMO challenge of 100K. And then I have the live account, the 50K FTMO. Um, so yeah, those are my free accounts. You can see lots of different data, lots of different statistics that uh, social trader tool, tool, tools track so you have the balance equity you have the how much you're up or down for the month or how much you're up or down in total very interesting stuff so a very very good thing we have here this button is the account hosting button so as i said i currently have three accounts and the max is five you you see how much more room, room you have and what plan you currently have so that's definitely a good reminder up here in the right corner so if you want to add a new account, you need to click on the configurator button, go to accounts and then click add account. You then just, so you then just put in all of your data, um, MetaTrader 4 or 5, name, number, password, classic stuff. And then it gets added to this list right here. As I said, I have three of them and they're all on MT5, so MetaTrader 5 they're all currently um, connected so the check mark is green which means they are connected and um, you can also see here this is green so that also means they are connected usually if they're not connected this turns red so after you have added all of the accounts you want to add you need to choose which one will be the master and then you need to set up a trade copier uh, you do that by clicking the configurator then the trade copier here I have two trade copiers. So my master live account uh, is my personal one. And then I have the first trade copier to my live FTMO account. The risk multiplier is 0.5. And the second one is the challenge account. And I have the risk multiplier, uh, which is two. So if you want to create a copier, you go to this button, create a copier. And then you uh, choose your master account. You choose your slave account. 
you choose your risk type so i have risk multiplier by balance that's that works for me that's the easiest one uh, for me to work out and then i just set it to whatever i need and then you just check all the boxes and click create a copier very easy stuff so yeah then everything is here on your trade copier i have two of them currently and so how it works um on my personal account i let's say i'm risking 0.5 percent and then on the challenge account i want to risk one percent that that means i put in the risk multiplier by balance of two that means it will risk two times as much and it will calculate by the balance of the account so that's exactly how it works you also can set up some email alerts right here uh, you can set up these email alerts if you want to alert when the stop loss is hit or when the take profit is hit um, what i have set up is that it alerts me when uh, the accounts have connected or disconnected that is the only thing i need personally to see if the trades are being copied um, so i did not have any big issues but i used to have issues with accounts disconnecting that has now been fixed i have not had those problems uh now in uh in a few months so that's really really good looks like they have, they have worked a bit on their servers being more uh, more stable and that would be it for the social trader tools platform uh what i would recommend after setting everything up go to your meta trader and check how the trades are being copied put it put in a pending order look at how the risk is being calculated check uh, double check everything and see if everything is in order and after that you can of course start trading um so everything is automatic and you can just leave it running in the background so definitely do double check on your meta trader um, when you connect the accounts and do check if all of the accounts are connected it will say uh, on the platform if they are connected it will be green if they are not connected the account will be red so that is the main indication um, and the main issue i kind of had with them not connecting so sometimes it just takes a bit more time for them to connect especially with the ftmos so just be a bit more patient that is it and let's now move on to the final segment of the video and that's it for the video guys i hope you enjoyed uh do check out my channel for daily trade recaps and forecasts i also post other interesting content so definitely subscribe like this video and check out my other videos so social trade tools is definitely a popular trade copier i use it most of the traders i interact with also use it we have had no problems so far i did have some issues with the accounts disconnecting in the beginning but they have kind of solved it i have not had any issues in the recent uh, in the recent months so i definitely recommend it link will be in the description and i will see you guys in the next one